Hey you guys, today I'm going to talk about being friends on YouTube. So I see a lot. By me supporting a lot of people in a lot of different parts of YouTube, um, I see a lot. I see breakups. I see makeups. I see people trying to get on through other people. Um, I see people supporting people. I see bomb ass collabs, all that, and I see them. And I and a lot of times I don't say anything. I just stay back and I just watch because it's better to watch and see how people move than try to hurry up and get this friendship with people and then you find out who they really are and you be disappointed. And by me watching reality shows, I've been pointed disappointed in so many times in people that I was fanning for so I show sure don't be um trying to hurry up and be friends with other YouTubers uh, people my subscribers I don't try to hurry up and be friends with nobody if it happens it happens and I have I have met some great people some great people on YouTube some of them are content creators, vloggers, whatever you want to call them. Um, and some of them are subscribers. I would say their name. <laughs> um, but the way things are on YouTube right now, I don't know if I want to. Um, no, I would because I feel like you have to know, like, I don't mind. You know me, I'm all about support and I don't mind telling y'all who I like. Um, if you don't like them, that ain't my damn problem. I like them. So, I support them. I don't care who, like, I just don't get into that beef and shit. I watch certain people for certain reasons. I don't, certain, some people I watch and I have no relationship with. Some people I watch and I have a little bit of a relationship with. Some people I watch and we like that. You know what I'm saying? So, um, that's why I am with it. Um, when I first started on YouTube, I, that was me, that I was the one that just watched everybody, I supported, and I let them know in their comments that I was supporting them, so I was known as the girl, the, the girl that always supports everybody, that's what I was known for, so that's when I came up with the, it's all about support, um, uh, slogan, because I like to support people, and then I felt like, Shit, when I didn't have nobody watching me, certain uh, YouTubers were commenting in my thing saying that they watch me or, and then I came up with certain YouTubers. So we built the relationship like that because we, we came up at the same time and we, in the era of me coming up in YouTube, when I first started, we were at the thing where everybody was wanting to support everybody. Everybody wanted a shout out. It was a big thing to get a shout out. Because it was like, right, I came onto YouTube right when they stopped doing video responses. Where you can do a video response to somebody's video. Um, I, have, I was watching it then, but I wasn't a vlogger then. So then I ended up becoming a vlogger and... I just would go to people's comments and was like, I support you, keep doing your thing, yada, yada, yada. And then people started shouting my name out because they knew I was supportive. Then I started meeting people. Me living in Vegas, it's a good thing and a bad thing sometimes. <laughs> um, people would be like, I'm coming to Vegas, I want to meet you. Oh, okay, cool, shit, you want to meet me? Cool. Then they would come, I would go and meet them wherever they, hotel where they were at, or we would meet on the strip or the Fremont Street, um, street Experience. We would meet and it would be genuine. It would be genuine. It wasn't never, oh, let's take out our phones. Let's, let's do a video together so people can see that we friends, see that we around each other. It, if, if I go to places, I barely bring out my camera to ask people for pictures because I want people to know that I support them from them and not for for what I can get from them or you know what I'm saying I so I see celebrities hi bye that's it I don't ask nobody for a picture if they say hey let's get a picture real quick 
we get a picture, but I'm not usually the one to initiate the picture. Um, but yeah, so, uh, who was it? Well, who did I first meet on YouTube? I know it was like a subscriber, but like, okay, my girl Keisha. Matter of fact, it was right after I had my surgery and I was very, very insecure. Um, I didn't probably show it because I was on camera a lot. I didn't give a shit because I wanted people to understand that you still have to press on regardless of what your situation and your circumstances are. So I still got on camera with my face big, bandaged up, all that stuff, right? But I was still inside was like, oh my God, I don't want nobody to see me. I don't want to really want to be outside. <laughs> But Keisha came to me, I, I'm going to say her name is Keisha because that's her name, but that ain't her YouTube name, <laughs> so I can do that. But she um, invited me to her family function. Um, her, her grandbaby had a party, and she invited me and my family. And um, we went, and me and her became instant, instant, instant sisters, like, like, Every time she's in Vegas, that's my sister. She's here. She's, I'm there. Like, where are we going? We need to link up. Like, I love her. Like, love her. Um, she's been there for me. Talk to me. All of that. Like, real friend. Real, real friend. I If she ever went back and told somebody some shit about me, I ain't, it ain't ever came back to me. That's all I'm saying. So, to me, friend, sister, love you. Holly. Holly is another sister. Like, I don't usually, because I usually don't call people my friends because, bitch, that's a title, title that you got to really, really, really work hard for. Um, Because I, I don't have too many friends. But... If I say you a family member, I really fuck with you. You know what I'm saying? It's like, bitch, we can fight. You know what I'm saying? Together. Like, fight together. Fight some people. Like, let's go. Um, but, yeah, Holly is another one. She, I came to her. Um, she, We met her being my subscriber. She was like, I'm coming to Vegas. And me and my um, dude is coming to Vegas. And we want to get married. And would you and your, hus uh, your, your husband stand up for us? And I'm like, yeah, like, cool. No problem. You know, I'm all for black love, love. And they've been together for a minute. And one night they just met each other and said, we want to get married. So um, we went. I was on crutches, <laughs> fresh from my surgery. I was on crutches. Went, me and her been sisters ever since. Like, every time she come here, she drive through. Where you at? You around the corner? I'm coming. <laughs> like, okay. Um, there's you don't free my I'm coming. There's some times that I haven't because my work schedule, but they know my heart if I don't show up. They know my heart. Um, Shelly. Michelle. I let me tell y'all something about crazy ass Michelle. Shelly is crazy. Like crazy, crazy. Like funny crazy, but crazy, crazy. Like about that life crazy. I was in the grocery store. And minding my own business. And she ran up to me and was like, the cat out here. And I'm like, who are you? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And she told me, she was like, I love your show, yada, yada, yada. And me and her just been cool. We've been cool. Um, then she came to Sayshawn Bradley's Num event. And she was always at the event. Me and her kick it all the time there. Me and her went to the Jess Hilarious concert together. Like, that's my girl. That's my girl. Like, crazy as bad shit. Like, crazy. She's that type of... She gonna, she gonna make herself known. And <laughs> I, I love Shelly. Like, I love her. Her birthday is Sunday, so happy birthday, Shelly. Um, who else? Before I get to, like, YouTubers. Um, it was somebody else I didn't want to forget that I met on. <sighs> Fuck. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to cuss either. But yeah, I, like I said, it's great content. 
creators also on YouTube. Um, I went to the blackout. And uh, if I if I forget somebody's name, it's just charge it to the game, not my heart, because y'all know it ain't like that. I'm, I'm just trying to think of things off my dome. But I went to the blackout, and I met, um, oh, wait, wait, before I go to the blackout, Stephanie, I will never forget you and your sister. She got a twin sister. Every time they come to Vegas and they on that strip, they make sure I'm, I'm over there. They, like, we don't care what time you get off of work. We don't care what, just come over here. We want to see you. So, shout out to Steph and her sister. They, they my peoples. Um, but, yeah, I went to the black, blackout. But before I had went to the blackout, I kind of got cool with everybody's boo Marquez. Like, that's my little brother. Like, if he called me and said, hey, we, we got to go do some shit, I'm there. Like, he start inboxing me and he was like, can I have your number? We start talking and then me and him just like been like this. Like, that's my little brother. Um, but he, he's very encouraging. He's very encouraging. So right before the blackout, I didn't know how I was going to get to the blackout. I didn't, the first one. I didn't know how I was going to get there. I was going through some things. I was trying to keep afloat. I didn't have no job. <laughs> None of that. So, you know, me and him talked. It was worked out that I got there. Um, and then he couldn't get there. It, something happened where he couldn't get there. So I was so, 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 so disappointed. Like, damn, I really wanted to meet him. That's my brother. We got to go hang out. We got to party. And then the second blackout came. And he came. And I was, like, super, like, super, super excited. I was super excited because I was like, this is somebody that I've been fucking with off of YouTube and there is nothing, people always say girls and guys can't be cool, it's always something, never, never like that been with him, never, um, I've always been his big sister, he's always treated me like his big sister and that's, that's what it is, um, He's very respectful, very cute. So, is he single? No, I don't even think he's single no more. But I'll just say. <laughs> um, but, yeah, he's always been respectful. When I when I seen him in Atlanta, I just grabbed him and held on to him because I know that, like I said, you can become really, really cool with people on YouTube. Um, then I went to the blackout, like I said, and, um, oh, my nail lady texted me. Hold on. <laughs> but um I went to the blackout and everybody that I met at the blackout was what I thought they were at the blackout. Like on the first one and on the second one. Justin J, Ashley Miller, Jamar 84, Forest Rocks, Bondi Blue, Sweet Addictions TV, Candy from Sweet Addictions, Precious, her her character. <laughs> um her sister, so I'm like with me, like they all were who I thought they were in person. Um, who else? Your boy Nunu. Oh, God, I found out when I saw your boy Nunu. I swear, I was so excited when we took the picture. I was like, oh my God, because I I'm a fan of his talent. You know what I'm saying? He he is like creative when it comes to his web series. So. I was excited. I fanned out for my YouTube crush, A Connections TV. Like, he's my YouTube crush because I know I can't have him. He don't want me. I can't have him. And and it's cool like that. So, I love me some A Connection TV. <laughs> Who else that? At the back out that I... Oh, Cameron. Y'all might know him when he do the little star Keisha. I'm pet the petty song and all that. But Cameron J. Henderson, boy, he walked in that blackout the second time, and I'm like, I fanned. I, you know how you fan so bad that you forget to ask the person for the picture. That's how it was. I, I, I forgot all thoughts when I saw him, cause I'm a big fan of his work. Um, Ashley, my girl. Ashley is my girl, like crazy. <laughs> Ashley is my girl. Um, 
who out? Everybody that was at the blackout. Like I said, Sean Sandridge, I met her at the blackout. Chris met the, him and uh, Devontae at the at the blackout. Them are my Keenan and Kel. I love them. Um, then like when say Sean Bradley and James and Alex and all of them was coming to Vegas. I, I'm cool with them. You know what I'm saying? I ain't never had no falling out with none of them. No YouTubers. So I'm good. Um, I've been cool with uh, S um, underscore Hutchinson. I, I was cool with Lady Nika. Um, Lady Nika. I, I, me and her was really, really cool. Me and Lady Nika was really, really cool. I don't know if we really, really cool now. <laughs> but we were really cool. Um, I just kind of fell back a little bit when she started hanging with certain people in YouTube because I didn't want to be involved around that negativity of certain people. Um, but, yeah. I I didn't have no falling out with Lady Nika when everybody else fell out with Lady Nika. Um, I just fell back a little bit and it wasn't because of her drama with them, with the whole Vegas situation. Cause y'all know I was still riding with her. Didn't give a shit about what nobody said. I fell back when she started hanging with other people. <laughs> Cause I just felt like it wasn't a good situation to be in. And I didn't want to involve my platform with that shit. Um, but James always been 100. Always been 100 with me. Sean always been 100 with me. I love my baby Alex. Him and his macaroni and cheese. I love me some Alex. I love me some Tiki44. See, these people, I shout out their name because I need y'all to know, like, I don't get in shit. I, I, I stay to who I am. I stay true to who I am. I stay positive. I stay being supportive to other people. If they're supportive to me. Because right now, YouTube is in this state of you can't be cool with certain people because other people get mad. And I think that's the dumbest thing ever. I think that's crazy to me. Um, I like, uh, what's her name? Michelle. Michelle Brown from um, Straight From The A. I like her. I like her channel. I love me some T.S. Madison. Like, love T.S. Madison channel. Like, I always watch her. Um, but yeah, I watch Five Babe channel. I watch Jay Wilson's channel. Um, I watch QB of the Midwest channel. I watch Leo the Lioness Queen channel. <laughs> like, I watch everybody. I just don't say anything because I don't want all of that drama. I don't want all of that beef. I don't want... I just don't want the negativity. I want everybody to be able to support each other. I just make this video to show you that we can be cool on YouTube. We can be supportive of other content creators on YouTube. We don't have to be beefing with other people. Like, it, for what? To me, it only makes yourself look bad. It makes it kind of hinders you from working with people that you probably really want to work with, but they'd like, no, nah, I don't know, because you move a little funny. Um, you don't want that to be you. And a lot of times I see it lately, I've been seeing it ever since the stupid ass super chat start happening, live video start happening where people are beefing. To make money. And I'll be like, so that's what you want your reputation to be? Is that you beefed for a dollar? Like, I know a lot of y'all been beefing. Y'all coins be looking pretty cute. But I'll be like, at the end of the day, your reputation is on the line. Because people know that you will do anything for money. That you will cut your own mama, cousin, brother, sister, whatever for some clicks and views. Like, what does that do to you? What does that say to as to you as a person? Like, and some eighty percent of y'all are over thirty. <laughs> I don't get that part. 
30 80% of y'all are over the age of 30. 75% of y'all probably got kids and y'all beefing. Hmm. I, I, that's the part that's hard to support. That's the part that's hard to be cool with people on YouTube that I want to be cool with. That's the part where I just be like, I'm just going to watch from the bushes because this is crazy to me. This is crazy to beef with people you can't touch. Then the way you guys beef, I be like, I'm gonna be in jail. Can't do it, won't do it, ain't gonna happen. Um, so I'd rather be positive, I'd rather be supportive. I so like I said, I support every section of YouTube, whether you do hair, you do nails, you talk about people, you beef about with people. As long as them bullets ain't hitting me. I just know how to move with your ass. That's all that is. Um, but I don't mind supporting you. I don't mind sharing your videos. I have a whole website that I can share your music, your videos, your clothing line, your hair. I that's that's me. That I rather I rather support you than hate on you. That's just me. Um, but that's all I have. Like I said. Everybody that I have met on YouTube, I've been really, really cool with. I ain't had no big falling out with nobody on YouTube. I've been on this platform for a very, very long time. And I've never been in a beef. I've never I, I've never had to be in a beef. Um, and I met some great, amazing people. I met some amazing people, whether what you think of them or not. I met some great people people and shout out to all the great people that i have met on youtube thus far let's keep rocking let's keep supporting that's what i do that's what y'all need to do <laughs> and i'll talk to y'all in the next video peace